All right, boys, it's revenge time. I've been uh, stewing on this World Series loss for a few days. I'm ready to jump back into the uh, Lions' den. Uh, this video is going to be like a little preview of the NL East before we play the opening day game. And, um, man, our budget is, is destroyed. Like, it's never been this bad. <laughs> like, I don't, I, don't, I don't play with, um, uh, uh, what is it, budgets off or whatever. Like, I, I got all the money, um, you know, it, it's all, it all counts against me. And, like, I can't make any moves because we're, like, $30 million in debt right now and projected to lose 31 more million. And uh, the payroll is 275 somehow. Like, I've never gotten it nearly that high before. I think last year we were, like, 240, 235. We were, like, barely under the luxury cap. But do they let me go to 275? Like, I didn't even know that was a thing that this game had. Like, I guess they coded in, like, uh, increases in budget or payroll or whatever because – like, I don't know how you let me do that. That's over $300 million. It's like Yankees territory. Braves have never had a payroll like that. But I guess winning three World Series in a row gets you quite a bit of dough. But, uh, yeah, uh, 242 next year. Look how that thing drops off. And then 128 after that in 82. Then we only have $48 million on the books for 2031. God, I'm such a good GM. Yeah, I'm tooting my own horn. I don't give a shit. I'm good at this shit. But uh, let's... Um, let's look at our... Uh, speaking of good at this... <laughs> like, I don't have to say anything. I mean, look at that. Yeah. Uh, Miami uh, should hold their own once again. Um, you know, that's a respectable lineup here. You know, they don't have any superstars or anything. They lost um, Gavin Lux to, uh, I think, Chicago or Detroit. But uh, they're still pretty solid. The uh, Mets, their uh, lineup is, is almost on par with us. You know, they got uh, they got Alonzo, Devers, um, Beatty's uh, reaching uh, almost at uh, star territory. Um, Bo Bichette, who had a rough year last year. Like, I think he was like in negative war. Might have just, yeah, he was. He barely got. Oh, he had a good second half. He was in negative most of the year. And like, I don't think this is worth what they're. Well, actually, they're not paying him that much. Nowhere near what I'm playing Vlad. So, you know, I guess that's pretty good for nine million a year or whatever. But anyway, this is stupid. Uh, Tim Anderson, Vinny Pasquantino, Bryce Harper, Trey Turner, Tyler Stevenson, Kyle Schwarber. Oh my God, Bryce and Turner Grisham. You know, I'm gonna say that name. Uh, what? Like Will Smith and Rio Muto on the bench, man. Phillies. You're pissing me off, man. Get it together. That is ridiculous. What are you doing? Look at these numbers. Man, 300 last year. Will Smith, it's 279. Man, what are you doing? 25 homers? Why is he on the bench? I understand Tyler Stevens is really good on this game. But what are you doing? Why not start one of them at DH? Tim Anderson is not a D There's no, man. I, I don't know. How did Tim Anderson have 27 homers last year? This game is, is wild, man. Anyways, uh, and the uh, Nationals are still rebuilding. <laughs> Seems like they're going to be rebuilding forever. Um, yeah, um, we got Strider, Freed, McKenzie, Whitlock, Elder. This has got to be the best in baseball. And the bullpen is, is upgraded. Um, man, Miami, they're holding their own. That, that is a hell of a rotation here. I like it a lot. And they, got, they finally got them a closer, got them a setup, two setup men. I like that. Uh, Mets, you know, it's pretty uh, top heavy. It's not really, <laughs> yeah, it's not good. Uh, and Phillies, pretty solid. Zach Wheeler's getting up there in age, but uh, he's got one one more good year in him. And uh, they're pretty much solid all the way through with 80s. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be a tough season, but I think we can win the division. Hopefully, we can get back to the World Series and get some redemption for last year. I still feel bad about that shit. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's going to be a, a very fun year. It's going to be wild. Thanks for watching.